It was almost two years ago when the Sanford and Edenville dams in Midland County failed, essentially draining four lakes. But today, as the state toured the dams that are currently under reconstruction, hope remains strong that people on Smallwood, Secord, Wixom and Sanford Lakes will one day have their lakefront property again. Midland County's recovery is Michigan's recovery. Lieutenant Governor Garland Gilchrist leading a tour of the Sanford Dam area, updating the progress thanks to the $200 million federal funding that he calls once in a generation. The amount of resources that are available to communities like this to invest in and strengthen our infrastructure is unprecedented, and I don't know that we'll ever see it again in our lifetimes. Our goal at all of the dams is to be able to pass the 100-year storm, which is kind of the regulated storm. Adam Heinrich is the construction manager on the Four Lakes Task Force. The team is working on the Northern Lakes first, Secord and Smallwood, and working back towards Sanford. Now here at Sanford, you can see where the water reached the embankment and it's going around the spillway structure itself. Our job is to get the river going back on its correct path and rebuild the earthen embankment to contain the water. The lieutenant governor wouldn't commit to a timeline, but Heinrich says the goal is to have the first two lakes back to normal by the spring of 2024. And getting all the lakes back is the only option for locals. Yes, people want their lakes back, and yes, we're planning on them coming back. So in the meantime, we're rebuilding the municipality, the business, the residents, and so we're ready for the water to be back. In addition to that $200 million, another $40 million is available for general dam safety for dams all over Michigan.